This brings me to Tekken 6's biggest mistake. It's loading screens. The customization menu is unusably slow, because it has to load each item from the slow read speed of the Blu-ray disc, it seems. You have to load the customization screen, load your character's default model, select the model you actually want so that that can load, Wade through duplicate items of different paint jobs in the menu. Select what you want, it won't just show you, it has to load the character model for that as well, but at least you can skip this loading if you already know what you want. I don't know how you would, because you can't fucking see it. The PSP version fixes this by just loading faster and having individual items that change colour in a different menu. Installing to the PS3 hard drive makes every match take 10 seconds to load, and most matches don't last very long say, 20 seconds per round, and it defaults to two rounds. Therefore, you spend approximately one-fifth of your time waiting to play the game. Saving takes five to ten seconds, and it will do this when you enter or exit customization menus, and after every session or scenario stage. To play each character's story mode, you have to load the scenario campaign character select, where it has to load your character model before you can select them, load the campaign map to select the arena, load a second character select for the arena, where it has to load your character model before you can select them, then get ready for the next battle. Pop on the kettle, fucking catch up with your texts, because there are going to be long-ass load screens between each and every fight, even rematches. What is the game loading in these instances? Do you want to make those loads not 30 seconds? Or are you going to be hanging around for 15 minutes on the first boot so you can install the game twice just so you can play it more often? And going into the menu to select Quick Select so you don't have to load models in the Character Select. If you want to play Tekken 6 for its gameplay, just set up the PSP copy somehow or on a hardware memory stick. It doesn't even look that bad, it maintains much of Tekken 6's art style despite the gap in their hardware. It's an astonishing port, though I believe it's just using a custom build of Dark Resurrection. Goes to show how little's changed in the game systems. Happy birthday to Tekken 6, and thank you to all the Patreon supporters who made this video possible, past and not too present.